Morning guys, we're back out here at the Three Brothers property. Um, I don't know where the sun went. It was a nice blue day, but clouds moved in as I was driving out here. So we'll just go with it. I don't think it's supposed to rain, but we're gonna go ahead and get this hobo stove installed. I got some bricks from my sister and I'm gonna stack them up around the outside of it and bring you guys along with me. I'll bring uh, some more roof out. I'm gonna fill this up with brick, bring these bricks out, and we got the stove. All right, so let's get it going, and we'll bring you along with us, so stay tuned. Thanks for coming out, it's your favorite adventure nerd. Thanks for coming and checking out this edit. It's Willis at the 10 Hit Kid. It's your favorite adventure nerd. Let's get out there and let's have some fun. Check out those handles we put on there. Made them out of wood. Lift it up, tuck it behind that screw. Pretty simple setup. tripod today so have to be resourceful use rocks and tops of cars and tops of backpacks you know. got some charcoal down here to go inside of this fire
heat up some lunch, got some hot dogs, and uh, throw them over this little fire. Went ahead and started the rocket stove so I could cook something. So. Okay, we got the fireplace in. Stove, hobo stove. I think that's where I want it. I mean, that's the spot. Scoot it over just a little bit. Cut this chunk of grass out. Scoot it over. I think that'll line up better. Then I can have the roof coming down still. Hopefully we'll see how it works out. Might have to move it over a little bit more. If that's the case, no biggie. We'll make it work. We're back, we got the stove put positioned into a good position. I'm about to build these bricks up on the back side of it and then get the uh, roof lined up and cut it out. I brought some tin snips with me, so let's keep moving. I'm going to eat some lunch real quick and then we'll be back with you. Thanks for checking out these edits. Get a little mark up. Pull it back here. I'm going to bolt this piece back on here. There, kind of close that hole off a little bit. Hobo lean to coming together. Look at that. It's crazy. We come back down here with the drill, bam, bam, bow, and some screws. And then, uh, be good to go i might get some wing nuts or some uh wing screws something i can pull in and out make this thing a little bit more temporary i don't know we'll play around here for a little bit i got a little hammock see what time it is got a hammock i'm gonna go set it up and who knows what we're gonna do the hobo lean to is looking pretty pretty good though huh And or Trek double person hammock. It's got two straps, two carabiners. I'm gonna hang them up in between these two trees and we'll see how these work. Stay tuned. Got my little hammock up. It's actually a pretty big hammock. I think two people can fit in here. out and give you a good look at it all my change fell out of my pockets it's definitely a you know nylon hammock similar to what everybody else is using right now uh, it's a little bit wider because it's a double person hammock it works real good between these two trees I'm gonna have to figure out how to use this strap system because there's a way to tighten it up and use it between trees that are a bit closer, but this is the first time using it, so. It worked out good. It's a pretty good looking little hammock. A lot of the riggers that I work with uh, use these and they'll have them with them underneath stage. 
So in between show or in between calls, they'll hang out under stage, hanging in these hammocks. Sometimes you look under the stage and there'll be five to 10 hammocks underneath of it. Pretty cool. Here's the hammock. There's the lean-to. Let's go see what time it is and get probably get back to town. I'm glad I got that stove out here. So that's done and out of my driveway. And mainly out of the back of my car. <laughs> the old hobo stove it seems to work pretty good i can feel the heat back here plenty it's definitely not a cold day it's cool and breezy but i'm pretty sure it's going to work very well i'm betting these bricks are going to hold heat extremely extremely well see my handles you didn't see that last time john boy came over and had the idea to put some wooden handles on there because i couldn't think of what to use as a handle and so we cut down a couple pieces of wood a couple screws in the back here hold these pieces of wood here put some uh, metal washers and nuts in between to give some spacers and we had it burning all one one night and they never got too hot to grab uh, they seem to be working pretty well so we're gonna keep going with it we Appreciate you out there, John Boy, for the great ideas and for helping with the stove. Because it really came out well, if you ask me. It'll heat this little thing up very nicely. Yeah, what did you get into? Got into something. Back out here at Three Brothers property. Uh, there's hunting going on, it's deer season. You didn't know <clears throat> it's deer season i heard a loud shot from over there so when i pulled in on my property i went ahead and honked a couple times and hollered a couple times i actually have a hat over there that's like a real bright pink uh it's just to kind of if somebody's in my woods i don't know let people know that i'm here so they don't shoot me and think i'm a deer we're back here at the property we're gonna go ahead and screw these uh screw the roof in so the wind doesn't take it away it actually ended up raining last night and getting a little windy uh and it didn't get messed up i think if you can see over there it's back tucked away in the trees in every direction pretty well we're wandering back to the property we're staying on this high side because like i said it rained a little bit last night so everything's pretty sloppy down there uh Ooh, I don't know what that was. And yuck. <laughs> that dog just threw up something funky. Bird up there. I don't know if you can see him flying around. start a fire in here we'll see what it does and it kind of maybe blocked the rain from coming in on here too a little bit not really but we'll go with it
여기 있죠. 요, 요 거기. 여기. Got some old porcelain. I'm gonna range it back in here. All right, more mass to heat. Take some of that heat, absorb some of the heat, and uh, radiate it out over the night. Hey, once again, it's your favorite adventure nerd, Willis at the 10 Hit Kid, your favorite adventure nerd. Thanks for checking out this edit. Go to like, subscribe, comment below. See you on the next one.